The first person to be diagnosed with rubella in Travis County in 20 years had received her MMR vaccine. Her doctor says the woman wanted us to clear the air about her vaccine story and her history. KXAN's Alex Capriello spoke to the doctor and explains how something like this can happen. After researching it, we decided to uh, go with the best research schedule for vaccinations. She's up to date with the shop. The issue of can someone get sick with the vaccine? Yes, someone can. It happens when your body loses its ability to fight a virus you're vaccinated against over time. By age 20, about 10% of people have lost their immunity. It's called waning immunity. And the reason that we've never really evaluated that or talked about boosting MMR in adults in the United States is probably because we thought we had eradicated both measles and rubella. Dr. Sharon Houseman Cohen, whose office diagnosed this recent rubella patient, says vaccines are still necessary. In fact, she believes this patient had a mild case of rubella because she was vaccinated. I think that we saved Austin from having more of a public health you know, issue. We're still finding out more about this case. We've learned that the patient is a school teacher and that unvaccinated students will be required to stay out of class for 21 days. Luckily, the doctor told us that's only one student at the school. Even still, parents are concerned. You know, it worries me a little bit when people choose not to vaccinate their kids just because it doesn't only affect your kid, it affects um, the whole community. The doctor asked parents to be safe and to find your doctor if you have any questions. Dr. Hausman Cohen suggests going to your doctor if you have any sort of international travel plan. They're going to take a good look at your immune system and decide whether or not you need any booster shots. In Austin, I'm Alex Capriello, KXAN News. And it can take 10 days after exposure to develop symptoms and you can be contagious after that for up to seven days. But keep in mind, rubella is quick and may not show symptoms at all. It's important to know whether you're fully vaccinated against measles, mumps, and rubella before traveling overseas. Right now, there are measles outbreaks in several countries, including Israel, Thailand, Vietnam, the Philippines, and Japan. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention reported a rubella outbreak in Japan two weeks ago. They say pregnant women should avoid traveling there if they haven't received the MMR vaccine. Keep in mind, Japan is hosting the 2020 Summer Olympic Games. An estimated 600,000 overseas visitors are expected to attend.